Hi Year 10, welcome to the first lesson for this week. Today's lesson is going to be looking at why there was a growth in hospitals during the Renaissance period. For today's lesson we've got three learning objectives. Number one, to know the difference between medieval and Renaissance hospitals. Number two, to understand why there was a growth in hospitals during this period. And number three, to judge how much change there was in hospitals. For our first learning objective we need to understand the difference between medieval and Renaissance hospitals. Pause the video now and complete one of the three tasks on screen. Use the table to help you. For our second learning objective, we need to understand why there was a growth in hospitals during the Renaissance. Developing students, open and complete the quiz on Renaissance hospitals. Secure students, complete the developing task first and then rate out of 10 how much hospitals had developed during the Renaissance. Explain your decision. Mastered students, which of the Gatwick factors had the biggest impact on the growth of hospitals? Explain your decision. For our final learning objective, we need to be able to judge how much change there was in hospitals during the Renaissance. On screen now is a mind map containing information about Renaissance hospitals. Developing students, can you identify two things that changed and two things that stayed the same in hospitals from the medieval period? Secure students, can you complete the developing tasks first and then add two pieces of supporting evidence from today's lesson? Mastered students, can you write a peel paragraph explaining how and why hospitals changed during the Renaissance? Remember to take a picture of each of your completed tasks for class charts. So that's the end of your first lesson for this week, year 10. What you need to do now is to upload pictures of your completed tasks onto class charts. For task one, can you upload a picture of your summary of the similarities between medieval and Renaissance hospitals? And then for task number three, can you upload a picture of your work showing the changes and continuity of hospitals? Well done for completing your home learning this week. We look forward to seeing you soon.